when our rooted group started in January of 2019, for me, it, that was like my first rooted group that I was ever getting to lead as the small groups pastor. I'd led a lot of different groups before, but it was the first time for me leading like a group of all people that I didn't know and all people that were kind of like different ages and different expectations and different hopes. And But then by the end of it, it felt like we were in a way like kind of family. I had been used to going to big churches a lot, like in North Carolina. I move around a lot, so I liked going to a big church because I could remain kind of anonymous and miss Sundays and no one would notice. What was different here was I didn't want to be anonymous because I didn't know anyone in the area. I had just moved here, so um, doing Rooted was a really good way to meet people and get to know friends. We have a lot of similar stories that just being able to be open within the group um, and just being able to share my story and hearing like their point of view or and like just knowing that they're supporting me and at the end of the day like they're not judging me. It just felt really good to not have to like pretend, kind of put on that like good Christian, I guess like persona you put on sometimes. I felt more transparent, more genuine for sure. I felt like it was special because it was like we cared for each other, right? We were praying for each other. You know, God heard my prayers of being in the community group and um, and also just answering some questions that I had about my faith. I think it's kind of funny that I feel like I see you more than I see like my regular friends. Like I see you guys like every week and I think about it, I'm like, uh, I don't see my regular friends as much. It doesn't just end when the program ends, like you can continue on with your group. And I thought that was something really special too that I actually didn't realize was something that was going to end up happening. And so it's really cool to see that. That's the success story is you guys are in Rooted and then you become a community group after and you continue meeting. I celebrate that and I love that you guys are still meeting. I don't know about you guys, but for me, it was kind of obvious that we were gonna stay together. Like we just all really connected. So when Chris asked, do you guys wanna stay on as a community group? I don't think anyone said no. And yeah, if we were meant to be alone, you know, we wouldn't have been designed to be in community. And I realize now that community was definitely something I was missing. I would like the group to grow more like to bring more people to the group. It would be nice if, if uh, other people can join uh, our group, and we should pray for, for that and grow more with others. We also want to do things outside of the group now, doing more activities together, and I think that'd be more fun and just would help our relationships with each other. I think that's where the future of this group is going, is we're just going to start seeing each other more often, which I'm looking forward to.